well, up till now, Beat the Odds has only focused on professional football. But as we go on, we're going to start sprinkling in more college football talk as well. And Teddy, of course, you're an expert in both sports. Um, how is betting on pro versus college maybe a little different? Sure, let's talk about it. Because when the pro football, the public can have some impact on a point spread. In college football, there's no impact whatsoever for any public money. It's all designed, every point spread, every total is designed to beat the Sharps. They could care less about public money in college football. <laughs> now, when it comes to the hype in college football versus the reality, only the public teams get hyped. You see it every year, you see it every week. You hear about Clemson, you hear about Ohio State and Georgia and Alabama, and that'll be the case this year, is the case last year, it'll be the case next year. The top teams get hyped and everybody else kind of gets ignored. So you can find some legitimate value on the smaller teams from major conferences and on the smaller conferences in college football. Look. The best point spread teams this year, the top three in college football, Tulane, Kansas, UConn. What? How about that? Yeah, you're not talking about the hype teams. You're not talking about the top 25 teams. <laughs> the the Ballyhoo teams? <laughs> you're talking about the less Ballyhoo teams. 22 and 4 combined uh, against the spread from that trio of squads, and they're not the only ones. <laughs> so the less hype squads can absolutely make you money.